Thanks for joining me for MTI's Whiteboard Wednesdays. I'm Dan Adams. Today we're talking about low force friction welding. Today we want to introduce you to a brand new style of solid state joining. We call it low force friction welding. We've introduced you to rotary friction welding and linear friction welding and friction stir welding, all ways to make a solid state joint using friction to generate heat. But there are other types of solid state joining, and I think it's interesting to tell the story so that you can see where we are coming from with low force. So if I took two blocks of aluminum and set them on a table at room temperature, come back 100 years later, those two would have formed a solid state bond between the two of them. It's just natural. Metals want to join to each other. But if I want to accelerate that process, I can add some force between those two blocks and some heat, and we call that diffusion bonding. This is a process that's used in the aerospace industry. It creates very high quality solid state joints. The problem is it takes a really long time. And if I want to make hundreds of parts a day, I need a way to accelerate that solid state joining process. This brings us to friction welding. Friction welding uses no preheat, but uses relative motion and high force in order to create friction so that we can elevate the, the temperature at the weld interface uh, and make that solid state joint much faster. No preheat, relative motion and force. So this difference sets up a continuum, if you will, between diffusion bonding on one end, no relative motion, 100% preheat. On the other end, we have 100% relative motion and no preheat in order to make two different types of solid state joints. In the middle of this is what we call low force friction welding. So if I'm using an external heat source in order to raise the temperature at the interface, I no longer need the high force that's needed for friction welding to generate this energy. I'm using the external heat source for the energy. I add a little bit of relative motion to accelerate the process compared to diffusion bonding with the preheat, and now I have an excellent source of a solid state joint. As a result, I'm making a friction weld at a fraction of the force, and this is our new product line that we call low force friction welding. Thank you for joining us for this episode of MTI's Whiteboard Wednesdays. For more information on this topic or other friction welding solutions, please visit our website at mtiwelding.com. <laughs>